This is a demonstration of using CMonkey and the WinSCP program. Uh, I'm assuming you have downloaded both CMonkey and WinSCP on your USB drive and the programs are working as they should. The first thing to do is always create a folder on your USB drive. This allows all the project files to be saved in the working folder. In this case, I'm going to be calling it temp. CMonkey is the web page development program. From the window menu, select Composer, and you are ready to compose your first page. If you notice, this interface is similar to a word processor. And once you're done with the web page, you can save it by giving it an appropriate name. Uh, make sure though that you save it on your USB drive in the temp folder that we created. Exit out of the program and you will see the file that you saved in the temp folder. The file name is going to be pointing to your USB drive. Uh, we will change this later. Next step to do is transfer it to the server. And this is WinSCP. The host name is stu.westga.edu. And you would type in your username and password. When you log in, you will see the public HTML directory and all web files are saved within the public HTML directory. You can create a brand new directory and give it an appropriate name. In this case, we are going to be calling it temp. Double click on the temp directory and all you have to do is drag and drop the files into WinSCP. Confirm that you want it to copy and your files are now transferred onto the server. When you are ready to test the file in your browser, you would open up Internet Explorer or Firefox go to stu.vestga.edu username slash temp slash index.html that's where we stored our files and you will see your web page come up exit out of the browser and close WinSCP